Metaplace is an open platform so that anybody can build virtual worlds. If you think back to how the internet used to be, we didn't have pictures, we didn't have music, we didn't have video. It was just too hard to do. But now, you can have all of these on any web page on the internet. What Metaplace does is allow you to have virtual places on any web page on the internet. So let me show you how you do it. You come over here, you can create a world with just a few clicks. First you choose a style sheet. It's a lot like a theme for a blog. Your world will come with all of the logic necessary, no programming required. You might make an arcade game, you might make a chat space, maybe you're making an Amazon storefront. Really, you could make any sort of thing. You just choose a style sheet, it will come with art, it will come with all of the programming done for you. Then you can import artwork. Who doesn't have bunches of photos up on the net these days, Flickr, photo sharing sites, and so on? So you could import an entire directory worth of art with just a click. And then after that, you can name your world, which you could really call it anything. And in fact, we will call it anything. You'll notice you automatically get a URL, metaplace.com slash anything. You can actually mail this URL to anybody. With one click, they will be in your world. You get to give a brief description about the world so that people know what it is that they're looking at. Maybe it's some kind of sci-fi space adventure. But a different world, for example, might be this one. Maybe this is your apartment where you have friends over and you can chat. You can just walk around very simply, hang out, do whatever you like. Different worlds can have top to bottom. So, XML, in and out RSS feeds, whatever you want. We can come over here, for example, and look at the RSS feed for Boing Boing. One click on this, we'll actually launch it in the browser, and we'll be able to read the feeds right from there. Anything that you do on the web, whether it's links, web services, whatever, all of that just works in Metaplace, because we work the way the web does.